Hey, what's going on everybody? It's Frolix here bringing you another video on the channel. In today's video guys, I'm going to be showing you how you guys can get the duffel bag in GTA 5 Online working after patch 1.39 on PS4, Xbox One, and PC. Now, this is actually working after the date of May 18th, 2017. That's the day I'm making this video. So this glitch is still working after this date. So, it's a pretty awesome glitch, it will show you guys how you can get the duffel bag at any level, which is awesome, and at the end of the video I'm going to be showing you guys how you can transfer it to any outfit that you want, um, more or less in GTA Online. I've done it a bunch of times, it's really helpful so you guys don't have to keep repeating the glitch over and over and over again, but it's a pretty insane glitch, I hope you guys go on to enjoy today's video, if you do be sure to smash that like button, subscribe if you're new, and um, yeah. Uh, let's try to aim for 100 likes on this video, and if we can hit that goal, I will do another insane glitching video. I'm going to try to do, like I said, a top 5 to 10 glitching video um, very soon for you guys. So let's try to hit that 100 likes on this video, and um, yeah, let's see if we can do that, and then I'll try to get that video up for you guys. So hopefully you enjoy, and let's get started. Alright, so first thing that you guys are going to need to do for this glitch is to have a CEO and you're gonna need to invite your friends to the CEO now once you guys have actually invited your friends to the CEO or just random people it doesn't really matter as long as you have people in your CEO you want to go ahead into your CEO office and sit at the desk now if you're not a CEO you can join one and tell your CEO master or whatever to start up a um, mission inside CEO now this is one of those missions that you would get from um, like just normal missions like uh what are they called like the normal missions so you guys want to go ahead and get onto your computer so you're going to click x to get into the computer like i am and i'll show you the missions here in a second the special vehicle work that's what i was trying to say and um you guys want to go ahead and start up one of these missions now there's one specific mission that you guys do need to start up it's called asset seizure so you guys want to go ahead and start that up which is also known as this mission so you're going to want to go ahead and click confirm on this and as you guys can see I got one of my CEO associates, I hope that's my associate, I'm not sure, but um, you guys want to go ahead and start it up just like I am right now. So you download it, doesn't matter what you put it on, buy whatever you want, confirm the settings and click play. So you wait till he joins, alright whatever you left, I don't even care. So we're going to start this up. Now what you guys are going to need, the outfit that you want the double bag on. Now this doesn't really matter because there's a glitch to transfer the double bag onto another outfit. I may do this at the end of the video if you guys want to see me do that as well, because it's really easy to do. So, um, yeah, we're going to load into the mission, and you want to make sure you're the pilot. If you're not the pilot, tell whoever is the pilot to land the helicopter back on top of the helipad. So you guys are going to see in a second that I actually do this. So you want to go ahead and land the helicopter, and then you want to hop out. You're going to know that you have a duffel bag on. Go inside your interaction menu, go to inventory, and body armor. You want to put body armor on and auto show armor on. You want to go ahead and click it again until the body armor shows up. If the body armor does not show up, that is perfectly fine. So as you guys can see, it is now showed up. You want to back out of that, go to your job list, click square, and then X. What this will do, it'll kick you out of the mission, which is more or less quitting the mission. When you guys load back into GTA, you will have the duffel bag on your back. Now, I decided to make this video just because there were some people that think this glitch does not work anymore, but it actually does, which is awesome. So I do suggest you guys try it. Now, at this point in the video, I'm going to show you guys how you can transfer the duffel bag onto any outfit. It's actually a very, very easy glitch that has been around for a long time. So, yeah, I'll, when we load back into free mode, I will um, show you guys how to do that. Putting in now from that mission, I spawned in right here. I didn't think this was going to work because if you guys do lag out, the duffel bag will not actually be on your vehicle. Which kind of sucks, or on your person, I don't know why I said vehicle. But um, yeah, that kind of sucks. So, now I'm going to tell you guys how you can put it on any um, outfit. So you guys want to go back into your office. If you have a helipad there with helicopters, that's perfect. If you don't, go to the helipad in the city and just go and grab a helicopter and go up really, really high. Or even just go to the roof of some tall building if you're really, really poor. So... I'm getting inside my office right now. If you're in your office, just shoot up your duffel bag on, just turn around, go back to the elevator, and go ahead and go exit to roof. Now, you don't need a vehicle if you don't want one. It really doesn't matter. You just need to be able to jump. So now you're going to pick the outfit that you want the duffel bag on if you did not put it on the outfit you want in the first place. Or if you just want to put it on a new outfit too, that works as well. All right, so now that you're up here, 
you're gonna have the outfit that you want the duffel bag on already i do have the duffel bag on many outfits um so i'm just gonna show you guys here that i do have the duffel bag on some other outfits but um what you guys need to do now is go ahead and go to your style go to the outfits you want to put it on um so let's see i have the duffel bag on this outfit and let's say i want to put it onto this outfit so i'm gonna take it from this outfit and put it onto that outfit now let's say you guys have the duffel bag on your outfit keep that outfit on go ahead and jump off the building okay i just messed up there i need another parachute now so i'll be back in a couple of seconds when i go ahead and grab one all right guys i'm back you know because i'm a retard you know i just decided to be stupid and jump off the part where you know there's a side to the building so i'm pretty dumb for doing that so now that you guys have the outfit that you want the duffel bag on just like i have this outfit that i have the duffel bag on and you want to have the outfit that you want to put it on so what you need to do now is have the outfit you want to put on it on somewhere saved so i do suggest saving your duffel bag outfit just in case you mess up but what you guys need to do now is go ahead and jump off a building when you have a parachute pull that parachute now go swap to the outfit that you want the duffel bag on so we're going to style and going to that chillin outfit with my bathing suit now what you guys are going to be doing now is landing um landing from parachuting i guess now as long as you land properly and don't mess up it should be okay so you guys want to just go ahead and land and when you're taking off your parachute you want to switch to the outfit and you're going to notice the duffel bag has been put on that outfit as well now that's pretty much it for the video i decided to add this in at the end of the video just so you guys can know and yeah it's just a little two in one here so sorry guys for everything i know i've been talking a little bit weird this video but you know what whatever you guys still know how to do the glitch if you guys want to see the other video on how to do it the link will be down below um so go ahead and watch that if you want to do that if this glitch does not work in the future but that's pretty much it for the video hopefully you did go on to enjoy if you do want to see more smash that like button subscribe if you guys are new and i'll catch you guys in the next video peace